this is a preview for our paper, Perceptions in Pixels. Existing work on bias in image search engines focuses on narrow categories of queries, such as occupation terms and neutral objectives. Our work complements this existing body of work by analyzing people's real world image search queries. So we ask questions like, what do they search for? How representative are those results? Specifically, we focus on a subset of queries that we call open-ended people queries. These are queries that return images of people that are not predetermined. Our research questions focus on the most popular category of open-ended people queries. The representativeness of results in terms of perceived gender, skin tone, and age variation in representation across search engines and categories. And finally, refinement of queries using demographic words. So we answered these questions by building a browser extension to collect over 50,000 unique image search queries on Google and Bing from over 600 US residents. One important limitation is that these searchers skewed white and none were under 18. That being said, we collected the top 50 image search results for each of the 50,000 queries on Google and Bing in the summer of 2022. So next, we zoomed in on open-ended people queries by applying models for person detection, named entity recognition, and NSFW detection. After that, we categorized these queries into a WordNet taxonomy according to their cosine similarity with the category names. Finally, we sampled a subset of queries from each category and designed a mechanical Turk task to label perceived gender, skin tone, and age. We paid workers $14 an hour. So let's move on to our results. Um, the first thing that we observe is fashion is by far the most popular category for open-ended people queries. Queries related to art, children, and sports are also relatively common. In terms of representation, Search results on both Google and Bing are substantially skewed towards lighter skin tones and away from older people. We also compared representation in each category to a reference baseline. We found that the skews for skin tone and age were common across most of the top 15 categories. So in conclusion, we found substantial skews in image search results towards lighter skin tones and away from older people across both search engines and different categories. We also learned that fashion is an extremely popular use case for open-ended people search, which tying back to our motivation seems like a ripe opportunity for future controlled audits. Uh, for more details, please read our paper.